I thought really, he was on some more than cocaine, honestly. Yeah, well, you know, I, like when you coked up, you don't think nobody can hurt you. Yeah, that's, that's how he was fact. fighting. He was like this. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Um, I came on here to address this mm. bull fucking shit claim that I cheated. Lies. Yeah. Everybody knows that I don't cheat. Um, mm -mm. What can I say? You know, uh, why didn't they come out with this? before you know the fight if they found it before why would they let me step into the ring right. as a cheater and then come out with a victory and then they post this you know again um these are people that um are trying to attack me for whatever reason but um no weapon against me shall prosper mm -hmm. i never taken a steroid i don't even know where to get steroids at the end of the day um i barely you know take uh supplements um they're saying it's coming from the ashwagandha that's fucking retarded so and then lies. Get, uh, big lies. I beat his ass. Fuck out of here. Everybody yes. go to Warwick tonight. It's lit. And I was Let's with this it. guy every Woo! single day. And I never, ever saw Fuck him. the Haney. Welcome to another edition of I Am Most Sports with Pedro Justice. Ryan Garcia is a drug cheat. Ryan Garcia is a drug cheat. Boxer Ryan Garcia tested positive for banned substance. First reported by Dan Raphael. Dan Raphael. It was the first person to report. He said, breaking per multiple sources with knowledge of the results. Ryan Garcia tested positive for the band PD Osterin in a VADA test related to the Haney fight. Then he goes on to say Garcia t positive tests per source with direct knowledge fell for Osterin in two urine tests on April 19th and post fight. April 20th. April 19th sample also from Vada Letter screened positive but was not confirmed for the 19 norandrosterone. And so basically, this PED banned substance allows you to have extra strength, speed, endurance. And so, of course, you know the Haney's. They're not going to sit here and not respond. Devin Haney said, We learned about this situation not too long ago. And it's unfortunate. Ryan cheated and disrespected both the fans and the sport of boxing by fighting dirty and breaking positive. One, not once, but twice. I've always been an advocate for clean fighting, and this is an example of such. Ryan owes the fans an apology, and by his recent tweet, he still thinks it's a joke. He still thinks this is a joke. We put our lives on the line to entertain people for a living. You don't play boxing. This puts the fight in a completely different light. Despite the disadvantage, I still fought on my shield and got back up. People die in this sport. This isn't a joking manner. So, of course, Bill Haney has already had an interview that hasn't posted yet. And Bill Haney said, you trying to hurt my baby? We played it fair. We didn't do it like that. F boxing. This is some bull. I came from the streets. If you didn't know, Bill Haney came from the streets. You scared of Devin on a level playing field? I feel messed up over this. If you can brag about doing it, you shouldn't be on drugs. So right now, with all the negative memes, here's a positive meme for Devin Haney. This is Devin Haney's career right now, is what they're saying, is that Everybody was going against Devin Haney. All of the backlash, all of the memes, all of the laughing and pointing fingers. Even though it was still terrible advice by Bill Haney, look at Devin Haney now. Da -dun -da -dun. <laughs> da -dun -da -dun. <laughs> Bill Haney's gonna be on his interview tour. Yeah, yeah, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Man, I knew something was up because of the fact all day ryan garcia has been tweeting and posting look at this shirt he had made did he know he was on drugs now he's saying that he took some may have took a substance a supplement that didn't list the the banned substance in there but at the end of the day devin haney is still the champ and now his loss was going to more likely be overturned it could be a no contest Meaning that he will still be undefeated. It'll, this fight never happened. And Ryan Garcia is a cheater. Do you agree that Ryan Garcia knew what was up? He came in overweight. He, he came in there, roid up. 
look at the rage. They're saying this is roid rage. He was on the PDs, and that's why he was tweaking this whole presser tour. The build up to the fight, he was tweaking. That's why he couldn't control himself. And Devin Haney mentioned in the press conference that he's a clean fighter. And what did Ryan Garcia say? The only drug I've done is weed. Well, well, Mr. Garcia, it looks as though you may have done something else and you cheated. Now everybody's going to feel vindicated and justified saying, how could Ryan do this? Act crazy, not train properly, and still go 12 rounds with all of that power and speed. Now, the people that like Ryan Garcia, they're going to say, wait until the B sample, the B sample. Now, I don't know if this B sample is going to clear Ryan Garcia, but if it does, it's going to be a big whew, 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 whew. Ryan Garcia is going to be copping, please. I didn't know. I don't know what happened. The trainer did it. The strength and conditioning coach did it. I don't know what's happening. Huh? Now, Ryan Garcia has been saying all day that this has been fake news. And, and he's saying he's not going to do a rematch that he won fair and square. And he says a lot of things in here. Now, Ryan Garcia, the world is looking at you. He was with Dion at concerts with rappers diss tracks he said did he pay for his drug test he said why in the world would i volunteer for a drug test if i planned on taking drugs so now he's already copying please at the end of the day at the end of the day devin haney with all of the memes with everything going against him they better come out and say aha I told you he was a cheater. I told you he was doing drugs and more than just weed, more than just drinking. And now Ryan Garcia failed in the end. The only thing can save him now is the B sample. Dillian White, where is that B sample? Do you think now Ryan Garcia is going to get vilified and he's going to get banned for six months up to a year and a half? Who knows? Are, are you one of the people who says, I don't care about this. Ryan Garcia is still the man. If you think that way, that's disgusting because Devin Haney went in there fighting fairly and Ryan Garcia didn't. Let me know what you think until next time. It's Pedro Justice.